welcome to today's vlog. We are in Washington, D.C. We planned a last minute trip. We found cheap flights. Sam had some off days. So we're here and we're gonna bring you guys along. We got here yesterday afternoon and I didn't vlog, but what did we do yesterday? We went to dinner, walked around, biked to the National Mall at yeah. night. Which, which was, was amazing. It was so cool. Yeah. So today it's supposed to thunderstorm, so that means we're just gonna go to a ton of museums and it's gonna be fun. We'll bring you guys along. If I can video in there, I think I can. Hopefully it doesn't yeah. thunderstorm too bad. We're supposed to go to a baseball game tonight. The mm -hmm. next couple of days are supposed to be sunny, so we're gonna go to Georgetown. I'm so excited to go to Georgetown Cupcakes because I used to watch that show when I was little, so it will just be like Never a- Never heard of it. A completion moment for me. We'll see what this whole week holds. We'll bring you guys along and it'll be really fun. We just finished up at the Ford Museum and the Peterson House, which is where Abraham Lincoln was assassinated and then the house is where he died. Um, and it was really good, really interesting. Yeah. I love learning, all that all that stuff. Top five presidents, I would say. He ranks in the top five. Yeah, he did a lot of amazing things. In just four years, like he hardly made it into his second term. So now we're gonna find lunch and then we're gonna go to the Smithsonian. And I'm gonna be thinking, what's that movie? Night at the Museum or something? Night at the Museum. Yeah, It's a yeah. good one. It is a good one, I think. Anyway, so we're gonna find some food, walk Ooh. around, bless you. Thanks. <laughs> We got our hot dogs. It is starting to rain. It is about to pour. A tree just fell. Crazy. We finished at the Smithsonian. Not gonna lie, I wasn't, I wasn't really into it. Yeah. Like, I don't know why that didn't really interest me very much, but it did. I was like, okay, I'm ready to leave. So now where are we going? To American History Museum. Yeah, that sounds a little bit better to me. And yeah. then we're gonna do the Holocaust Museum. Oh my gosh, the whole time I'm spilling my coffee everywhere. Okay, so we just got dressed and changed because we are heading to the Washington Nationals game. We go to the game, eat there, and it's gonna be super, super fun. And then tomorrow, my plan is to meet up with my friend Michelle. Hopefully, we can make that work um, in either Georgetown or going to see all the monuments at the National Mall. Let's head to the game. I'm checking the Play weather. Play ball, shall we? Postponed. It's okay. So we might go see it tomorrow. They've got a game tomorrow. But we don't know what we're gonna do now. It's about to storm really bad, and we did almost everything that's inside today. We made it to dinner. Sam got a what? Burrito. Burrito. I got fajitas. The subway system had a delay, so we decided to bike back, but we just saw it lightning. So I'm hoping we can beat the thunderstorm. We'll see. All right, we just got into the room. Obviously, pretty soaked. My rain jacket hood would not stay up while I was riding, so my hair. It's just a mess, it's okay. I'll shower, but I think we're going to watch National Treasure. Mm -hmm. It's 9.30, it's kind of an early night since it's pouring. Um, whoa, did I just turn that on? So we're just gonna relax and enjoy the night and then we'll see what tomorrow brings. It's supposed to be cloudy and then I think the next day is supposed to be sunny, which will be perfect.
Good morning, it is day two in DC. So this morning we're gonna go bike around all the monuments and see all the memorials and things like that. And then I'm meeting Michelle Reed for brunch or coffee. And then after that, we're gonna head straight to the rescheduled game. They put it at 12.05, which is like not an ideal time because it's the middle of the day, but we'll make it work. Um, and then we're gonna go to Georgetown after that. And then tomorrow will be kind of like a fill-in day. We definitely still need to see the Declaration of Independence. We need to go to a couple more memorials. I really want to spend a good amount of time in Georgetown, which I think we'll do tonight. Go to Georgetown Cupcakes, walk around, see all the cute, quaint corners. I am so, so excited. So I haven't done an outfit of the day at all, but this dress is from made well but i got it off of thread up and then i have my handy dandy little like satchel thing and then this necklace is from amazon and my air force ones so let's head out for the day i think it's like 8 a.m we're getting an early start and we're gonna go bike all the money Okay, we just got back from the ball game. I just changed for us to go to Georgetown. We're gonna grab sushi. We're gonna go to Georgetown Cupcakes. My top is from Madewell, also from ThreadUp. My jean shorts are from Madewell. I actually got them this year, so I'll link them down below. I love them, they're so comfy. I've been wearing them nonstop. And then my Air Force Ones, cause they're comfortable. Sam, outfit of the day. All right, we got a Lululemon top. Okay. This is a polo that was gifted to me by Jacqueline's mother. And I got some Lululemon shorts that were gifted to me by my wife. I get a lot of gifts in Lululemon fashion, so if you guys want to do that, then send it to me. Figure out the address. And a cute little t shirt. Down by the sea. Sushi dinner. And now we're gonna walk along the river. I've determined Georgetown mm. is really cute. Georgetown's cute, it's but quaint. I will say I am happier in DC, like downtown DC proper. Where all the history is. Yeah, yeah, 100%. The architecture is way better. This is great, but it's there are a dime a dozen. There's so it's many different. cities just like this. There's nothing it it, it like gives Washington. me Savannah vibes, like yeah, that yeah, kind yeah. of thing. Well, all the dessert places were closed, which makes me so sad. So I think we're just gonna head back to the hotel. We're gonna bike back and call it an early night and finish National Treasure. Mm -hmm. That's all we've been talking about all day is finishing that movie. I don't know what makes it that much more exciting that we're in the city it was like based out of. Good morning, it is our last full day in DC. Our flight leaves at 6 a.m. tomorrow. Our taxi's coming at 4, so it's gonna be quite the morning tomorrow. Yeah. So we're gonna live it up today. We are doing... Let's see if you can remember. Okay. Four things. 
We're doing four things today. Four things. Tomb of the Unknown Soldier. Yes. We're starting off with that. Holocaust Museum, Declaration of Independence. It's a big old library. Oh, yeah, yeah. The library. Of Congress. Of Congress. Okay, so this is my outfit of the day. This is the shirt I got from Brandy yesterday. I love the details on it. My same Madewell shorts, my tennis shoes. I added higher socks because I was getting like blisters, so we'll see how that works. Ladies and gentlemen, may I have your attention, please? I am Sergeant Sprosty of the 3rd Infantry Regiment, United States Army, Guard of Honor, Tomb of the Unknown Soldier. cemetery so now we are back kind of downtown ish got coffee we're about to grab lunch at pot bellies pot belly just because we need something quick and easy and then we're gonna go see the declaration of independence i'm pumped especially after watching that movie last night i'm like are there really heat monitors probably not but i'm gonna be looking for we're them be looking for them and then after that, I don't know what we're gonna do. Probably go see the library. Library, Congress, then. And then if National we have time. Or sorry, uh, Holocaust. The Holocaust Museum. archives but we couldn't record or take pictures which I was really sad about did buy a replica Declaration of Independence yep and there's actually a secret map on the back you bought that version oh uh, there was a specific version oh crap <laughs> well, we won't get the trip we'll see we'll see these bikes from Capital Bike Share have been so great for our whole trip because you can pay like eight dollars for a whole day pass and yesterday I forgot how far we biked. I did it on my watch and then it died like midday and it was still like five miles or something crazy. Okay, the library is closed on Sundays and it is Sunday. So we're skipping out on the library. So we're gonna bike to the Holocaust Museum. How hot is it outside in the 80s? It's pretty stinking hot. 
So we got some water from Starbucks and we're gonna bike to the Holocaust Museum. Well, we biked two miles to the Holocaust Museum and it's sold out for the day. We didn't research at no, all. No, we really didn't prepare very much, but yeah. now what? Well, we could go back to the room. I want a pretzel. Okay, let's get a pretzel. We go back to the room, pack up, get ready for tonight, get dinner, and then bike at night. So that, you don't want to do that. I just want to be the one that makes the plan. So I, th I say we go get a pretzel, then we go back, pack, get ready for tonight, go out to dinner, and then go back. That's How's exactly that what I said. What? First bite. Wait, no ketchup or anything? Or sorry, ketchup. no mustard? Okay, we came back to the hotel. We kind of packed up a little bit and we changed clothes because we're gonna go on a date. We are both so tired. I'm good to go. Mm -hmm. I am. I think we're gonna go to this restaurant called The Founding Farmers. It's been recommended so much by you guys, by just like Yelp and things like that. So we might go, it's really close to our hotel. Um, but we are afraid that it will be really busy because it is Memorial Day weekend So there's a lot of people here. So we'll see and if not, we'll just find a place on the way. All right, let's head out